Get your water. He's getting so long. And big boy. Yes. My big boy. Stretch. You stretch. The baby and I are on our way to town. It is Friday today. And um it's been a crazy time since the hospital, since like my last vlog and everything. Everything has gone like downhill pretty quick um after the hospital and after we left the hospital and everything i was saying that i was hoping that josh and i would not get sick well we did get sick and the baby got sick too he was planning on leaving for training saturday and was not able to because he was so sick um like throwing up and everything so he ended up leaving this tuesday which was nice because we got a little bit of extra time with him and he was able to stay like and help us get better so after he left my sister came with her kids and we went to the park on I want to say Tuesday I think it was we went to the park on Tuesday and they all were doing fine like everybody seemed like they were doing great and then the next day they all got sick so all of her kids were throwing up and everything and she was sick and it kind of just was it was a mess so <laughs> this week has not been great um, she has been a tremendous help though because she has helped like doing dishes and doing laundry helping me like with the kids and it's been a blessing having her here um, they are not here right now she took all the kids with her to go see um, her husband's sister in Kentucky um, and her like kids and everything so they're over there doing like a little play date um, She lives about two hours away from us. So she took all the kids over there just to kind of give me a break um, And she has actually like watched them a few times. I went and got my hair done. I got it trimmed and then um, Got like highlights and then I was able to get my nails done So it's been really nice being able to do that stuff while she's here because I know as soon as she leaves I cannot haul three kids with me to go get those things done um, But yeah, Josh is gone um, And I don't know exactly when he'll be back and I wouldn't say it anyways um, on here, but he is hopefully going to be back sooner than later because we did not get as much time together as we wanted to with the baby. Um, an update on the baby, he is doing okay, um, but I'm almost 100% sure that he has acid reflux. So he's been vomiting a lot and he has like a really hard time keeping any milk down. Um, so that's like a little bit, it's worrying me a little bit because... I want to make sure he's like gaining weight and it doesn't seem like he is it just seems like he's eating a lot but he can't keep anything down and that worries me and I don't know if it could be my fault because I think my milk lets down really fast and I don't know if that's making him choke or like just get too much at once so um, he does have a doctor's appointment on Tuesday so I'm hoping they will give me some just some suggestions about what to do and how to take care of that but right now today is Friday and him and I have just been chilling around the house today um, it's been really hard to get out the door because uh, as soon as I get him calmed down he wants to sleep and then I don't want to wake him up and then he'll wake up and he wants to feed again and then after his feeding he has about two or three dirty diapers and then he pukes and then he gets the hiccups so it takes a while for me to even get out the door with just him so we are finally getting out the door and it's 4 30 almost the school bus is <laughs> letting the kids um go behind me they're like all the kids are getting out of the school bus behind me in our neighborhood but um i'm hoping that i can get to once upon a child today just to be able to look for some clothes for him because he has been vomiting all over everything and like pooping out all of his clothes so it's hard to keep him like dressed through the day and oh buddy 
he's not been very happy. So I'm gonna go to Once Upon a Child and Starbucks and then hopefully back here to the house. Here's your binky. Here's your bank. Yeah. They're sometimes giving you a hard time, huh? So that did not go as planned. Um, we got in there and I looked around for a little bit and I found him a few things, but um, he is freaking out. So I had to come out and feed him. <laughs> I had planned on maybe going to another store, but um, he is not doing good, so I'm not gonna like try to force like going shopping with the baby and trying to make him be happy when he's not. So um, I'm just gonna head back to the house. You ready to go home? You can go home? Yeah. So. Luda one is not doing very good, huh? Yeah. Say, I'm not happy tonight. No, sir. Lydia and the kids are gonna be heading back here in a little bit and they have like a two hour drive. So, just gonna be me and little one. I'm gonna show you guys real quick what I got from Once Pop Child. So the first thing I got him was this little um, sleeper. It's just like gray and white stripes. And then it's got this like little lion symbol on the side. And then I got him a plain cream one. Cause I like putting these under um, little jean jackets and then pairing them with like a little uh, hat and stuff. I think those are really cute. I got him a lot of sleepers because that's what he needed the most of. So I got him this like little lime green one. And it's it's like a lime green. Well, I wouldn't say lime green. Um, I don't know what color green that is. But it's green and white stripes. I'm trying to hold it for you guys with one hand, but it's not working very well. Um, everything I got tonight was zero to three because, like I said, he's not getting bigger like around his belly but he is getting taller it seems like because he's growing out of his newborn stuff so I got I went ahead and just got him zero to three um, just cuz he's so tall um, I did get him this little one it's just a plain gray it kind of looks blue on the camera but it's just a plain gray and then I got him these little jeans I thought they were too cute to pass up And then I really liked this little sleeper. Um, the next thing I got him was this adorable little sleeper. The print on it's just really pretty. Okay, let's see if he'll burp. There might be a burp in there. Um, another thing I got him was this really cute sweater. It's just like a cream sweater. That was really pretty for like church and stuff. And then I got him this little onesie. It's just um, plain color. But like I said, I like the little neutral colors. That is everything I got from Once Upon a Child. I'm going to see if I can get him to calm down. Hopefully I can video a little bit of the kids tonight. But if not, if not, I'll video them tomorrow before they head out. What you doing, Gabriel? Watching Daddy. And play it. Yeah. It's not over until I say it's over. And Daddy loves you. Daddy's gotta go to work for a couple of weeks, but he's a good mommy. He's a good baby brother. Does that help you? I know, baby. It's okay. Come here. 
You gonna miss me? Yeah. Yeah? What about Caroline? Your arch nemesis? Yeah. <laughs> They've been fighting all week. Maybe huh? take a nap. You need to take a nap? They woke up about 6.30, I think, wasn't it? Yeah. I think y'all are probably ready for a nap, huh? Uh-huh. Yeah. Bye, Marabella. Me want to see you. Wave goodbye. Goodbye. So Lydia and the kids just left. Um, it's Saturday morning, and the girls are still in their jammies. But um, we're probably just going to relax around the house today. I might take them outside to ride their bikes here in a little bit when it gets a little warmer. It's only like 20 degrees outside right now, so. Um, I don't know if they're going to really want to go outside, but, um, we don't really have any plans for today besides just re just relaxing for a little bit and I probably will clean up around the house. Um, Lydia helped clean a lot of it and helped do laundry and everything, but I might clean the bathrooms and stuff and, um, finish up some laundry. But we had a blast with them and I hate seeing them leave because that means it's me and the girls on our own and little baby boy. So, um, but hopefully it'll go well. <laughs> this is my first time like being alone with three kiddos. So hopefully it doesn't all go crazy. The baby's probably gonna be waking up um, soon to eat. So I'm gonna grab some breakfast real quick and try to eat before he wakes up. He was squirming a little bit like he was about to wake up. <laughs> Hi, buddy. Hi. You gonna wake up? You hungry? You stuck? Yeah. <laughs> you ready? Here we go. Go ahead. Oh. Go ahead. While the girls are out playing, baby boy is sleeping.
Yeah. yeah. Good job. Thank you for getting that, dude. Going to the deep. He's a friend. You're giving him a little spike hair look there, Missy. Here you go, Dasher. Here you go, Dasher. Look at your belly. Look at your belly. All right, Sunday morning. All the kiddos are in the car. We are headed to church. I'm making some grilled cheese for the kids and I for lunch. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog because we are probably just going to rest today. Um, I did get some cleaning done and in the house last night. I got all the bathrooms cleaned and I was able to get the kitchen cleaned. And then tomorrow I will probably tackle like sweeping and stuff. But one thing I've had to learn with like being postpartum and dealing with three kids is I need to take it easy and not try to do everything at once. So I'm going to probably do some of that tomorrow. But I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I'm sorry it's been all over the place. Um, but that's just how it goes when I don't have a lot of time to like video and kind of like plan out the videos. Um, and with Josh being gone, it's been a little hectic, but if you haven't subscribed to our channel, give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in our next vlog. Bye guys. Duh. You have to do it on here. <laughs>